Here are the stories making news in Tennessee tonight. School vouchers are officially back on the table here in Tennessee after a failed attempt by Governor Lee to get them passed last legislative session. But this time, Republican lawmakers added provisions that they say public schools will also benefit from. The Education Freedom Scholarship Act, as Republican lawmakers are calling it, would include $20,000, $7,000 scholarships funded with taxpayer money that Tennessee students could use to go to private school or other options if their parents choose. Half of the scholarships are reserved for low-income students. The bill was filed this morning. This has been a top priority for the governor after he failed to get his school voucher bill passed last session. The new version of the proposed legislation has some new elements aimed at drawing in opponents. One provision would allow public schools to keep the funding a student brings by attending even if they leave to go to a private school on a voucher. Democrats, though, say they still have some doubts. They designed the entire TISA funding formula around the money following the student when they leave the public school system. That was the reason they passed that, was to pave the way for their voucher scam and for their privatization schemes. So, you know, the fact that they're going to try to argue that they're not going to take the money out of those public schools, are they going to rewrite the entire TISA program? Uh, how is that going to work? It seems to me just another ornament they're trying to hang on a, on, on a dead tree here. Well, that's part of the legislation. That, that, is, that would be state law. So if, so if an LEA loses, according to what their formula would be, if there's students that disenroll, they would get the difference uh, in that loss under the piece of legislation. Bill also includes a one-time $2,000 bonus for teachers if that money is included in the next budget and a proposal to use 80% of the money generated from sports betting in the state to pay to maintain and build public schools.